Gagne. Merci. In France, food is given a special place. In the best restaurants, it is given an almost ceremonial reverence. And for the top chefs, the ultimate measure of their success is the Michelin star. But what if far from being something to wish for, the Michelin star was more of a curse? Marc Vera, one of France's most famous chefs, has earned nine stars in all. But in January, his Maison des Bois restaurant in the Alps lost its third star over a souffle that a critic said tasted of cheddar, an affront that Mr. Vera has not even begun to digest. Je suis prêt à accepter. Comme on lève la troisième étoile, il n'y a pas de problème. Mais qu'on me donne pourquoi Qu'on me dise pourquoi Ce sont, à mon avis, quelque part des incompétents. Vous vous rendez compte qu'ils ont confondu le roblochon, la tome, avec le cheddar. Ils ont dit qu'on avait fait un, un soufflé au cheddar, mais n'importe quoi. Now the 69-year-old is taking the Michelin guide to court. He says he no longer wants its stars and wants the guide to clarify the reasons behind its decision. But it turns out it's not that simple. While Michelin says Vera's talent is not in dispute, it insists its first duty is to inform the consumer. Food, especially in France, is about uh, passion, it's about emotion. Chefs are real artists, so they are quite proud, sometimes excessive, fragile, and uh, I think it's that case. He's saying, OK, I deserve three star because I am who I am. We have to, to avoid any kind of, let's say, emotional blackmail. It isn't the first time that the pressure placed on chefs by the star system has caused controversy. The 2003 suicide of the three-star chef Bernard Loiseau was linked to a system of intense gourmet critique. Several chefs have even asked for their stars to be removed, citing the psychological as well as financial pressure of maintaining their rating. 20 ans de ma vie, je ne dormais pas trois mois avant la sortie du Michelin. J'avais peur de perdre mes étoiles. Est-ce qu'on va le faire demain matin pour les avocats, pour les médecins, pour les garagistes, pour tout le monde mais, mais, mais de quel droit Mais de quel droit ont-ils ont le droit de faire ça Vera hopes the hearing today will force the guide to be more transparent about how it awards stars and more importantly, why it takes them away. Saskia Van Dorn, CNN, Paris.